Hex is a workspace for collaborative analytics and data science. It has three main components, a super-powered notebook, an auto-magical app builder, and a one-click publishing mechanism. In the next couple of minutes, I'll explain what makes these three components so powerful. This is the Hex logic view. It looks a bit like a traditional code notebook, and I can do traditional code notebooky things, like run Python cells. But it's loaded with new functionality, like the SQL cell, which is actually a rich and complete SQL IDE with autocomplete, a schema browser, caching, and more. One really powerful hex feature is the ability to reference the results of SQL queries or any other data frame producing operation in any cell, including other SQL cells. And this makes it possible to do what we call chained SQL. It's easy to write a quick data frame SQL query that rolls up the output of a previous query without touching Python at all. Of course, you can also reference data from SQL queries in other Python cells. It's these kinds of polyglot workflows that make Hex so powerful. Something simple like calculating a rolling average is just quicker to write in Python than in SQL, so I just did it in Python rather than in SQL. There's also no-code tools like table displays for beautifully rendering tabular data and chart cells, so you can rapidly build visualizations without having to dive into Matplotlib or other libraries. Hex also includes a library of interactive input parameters, which allow for user input and parameterization of apps. The default values for these can be fed from the results of previous queries or just provided statically. Once you've added an input parameter, you can use it to make any SQL or code cell dynamic in response to user input. Oh, and by the way, all Hex projects are completely collaborative and real-time multiplayer. I can see that my colleague is actually in this cell right now, but it doesn't look like they're doing very much, so I'm going to just take it over from them. We can easily make this data frame SQL query dynamic in response to user input just by referencing the input parameter in the WHERE clause. Any time that input is changed, Hex's graph-based reactive execution model will make sure that all dependent cells downstream of it in the graph are automatically reloaded, without rerunning any unnecessary cells that aren't part of that dependency graph. This keeps your logic view always up to date and free from any confusing state errors. So now I've got some work that I'm actually really happy with, and I'm ready to turn this into something that I can share. I can tab over to the app builder once I'm done analyzing to turn this kind of messy notebook into something that I'm really proud to share with my entire company. Hex can auto-generate an app for me, taking all of the elements from my logic view and organizing them into a pre-built app. It's really easy to customize this so I can remove these couple of scratch elements and maybe consolidate things a little bit or even resize things. And Hex's grid-based layout engine makes it really easy to move elements around and snap things to a grid. Okay, cool. I'm happy with my app and I think that I'm ready to share it. It only takes a second to publish this analysis to a URL that anyone can view without any Python environment or technical know-how. I can share it with just a specific person or team, my entire company, or even open it up to the web if it's not sensitive data. Once published, anyone with the URL can view this app just as quickly as loading a web page, and it's completely interactive. You can even embed the entire app or just cells from it in any website or Notion doc. And because I've published this app with an approved library status, it's been automatically added to the Hex Knowledge Library, a trusted index of company insights and knowledge where anyone can discover it. There's loads more features that don't fit in a five minute demo. So if you want to learn more or just try Hex out for yourself, just click get started on the homepage and you'll be right in.